All right, guys, welcome back to Dragon Age Inquisition. I am feeling much better than I was. I think I finally got over that stupid sickness I had. I did sleep in today. That's why I'm getting such a late start on the game. So let's jump in because the kids didn't have school today in service day. Um, and I'm like, yeah, yeah, I can sleep in, you know. Josh made him made him breakfast for me. He got him some really uh, cool Halloween pop tarts and. They finally discovered Pop-Tarts because we had been holding off on Pop-Tarts because you know how it is. Once you have one Pop-Tart, you want all the Pop-Tarts. But they're not exactly the healthiest thing to eat, so <laughs> we're just like, no, nah, we'll just pretend you don't worry about it. Oh yeah, that's right, we're in the Fallow Mire. It's probably my least favorite place. Just because of the zombies. Sorry, they're annoying. Yeah, I slept in late today. I was tired. I'm just super califragilistic tired. Whoa, Sola's gone down there, buddy. Alright. So we got some houses. Oh, I see something. That's what I'm doing. Shut up. What's in there? Y'all. There's a thing. Short note. Helen, I won't be in tonight. Rupert said he had a surprise for me. Probably death. He teased me by saying Lady... Peasley, which he always does when he's trying to impress me by pretending he's not impressing me. Don't tell mom where I am. I made fresh porridge in the red pot for both of you. I'll care for her tomorrow, I promise. Lucia. Yeah, yep. Sounds like death. <coughs> Before Androstianism, forgotten faiths. Ah, uh, yes, yes, quite. Forgotten faiths, yes. There's a lot of stuff in here. Look at this. This. It's alcohol. Yep. A lot of booze in this game. Hmm. Wonder if I need this or something. Uh, I feel bad about it. <laughs> someone's uh, someone's death shrine. Um. Huh. Yeah. There's a lot of alcohol that you find in this game, but it probably harkens back to, you know, we were me and Josh, or Josh is telling me about how back in the day they used to drink a lot of beer, uh, and it wasn't all like super like alcoholic you know it, it had like watered down versions of it where it's like you had the super the super alcoholic beer then you had like the stuff that was practically just water and um they used to drink a lot of that because there was a lot of sickness but what they didn't realize is that you know with making beer they were boiling the water and stuff and they didn't realize that boiling the water was killing the diseases <laughs> they just thought well we drink beer we don't get sick so, you know. Diary of Peter Marsh. The gardeners are too sick to save, everyone says. Grandfather and my brothers barricaded them in their own house so they wouldn't make anyone else sick. Yelled at me for watching instead of helping. Said it was for our own good. There's no more lights in the gardener's home. Ravain. That's what he was reading before he died. That's right. There was a plague that came through here. That's right. I remember that now. A lot of people died. I can't remember if it's up here that I have to stab my stick in to make it mine. Yes, it is. This is mine. No, go away. No. No, no, you're unwelcome. Look at him. Look at how they run. It's fine when it's like a couple at a time, you know what I mean? But, damn, they just... They, uh... They'll come at you in like huge ass groups of zombies. And I'm always like, leave me alone. <laughs> yes, you're right, Inquisitor. There's probably a shit ton. I'm guessing this is the gardener's house. Hello? No horror. That's enough for the ambiance. <laughs> the music in this place also sucks. <laughs> it's like, do you like scary stuff? Um, I mean, not really, but. I'll deal with it when it comes at me. <laughs> That's Look. what you mean. Signs of a plague. It must have been a terrible illness. No one's come to reclaim the land. No one living at any rate. I love it. <laughs> I love listening to Solus talk. I know that's probably that probably sounds weird to people who aren't as into voice actors. There's something about his voice actors. The way that he like pitches his voice and stuff. He sounds so poetic when he talks, you know? 
He sounds very old world. Which, oh yeah, I forgot about the fucking lightning. <laughs> I forgot about that shit. I hate it. Um, he just sounds very poetic. In the way he talks and stuff. Um, like he sounds like... He's older than everyone else, which he is. You know, he's, he's a god. Well, he doesn't see himself as a god, but you know what I mean. So when he talks, he just has like this certain like pitch and tone to the way he says things. I need one of you fools. Thank you, bull. No, it's locked. That's not nice. Breaking. I'm being you all I can. I'm surprised that that even worked a little bit. It's still locked? No, no, no. Oh, it, oh my god, really? Uh, no! <laughs> Don't touch me! Um, oh, I hate that, ah, oh, that sound. That sound it made when it got up. The empty ones. The Empty Ones were a small and short-lived culture based in Navarra and known for worshipping the Blight. Ew. Why would you worship the Blight? Alright. Gardener Diary. Property of Ira Gardner. is written in spidery handwriting on this collection of homemade recipes and remedies. The last entry reads, First sign of the plague is coughing and going pale, like bloods run out of your skin. Elfrude soothes the cough but doesn't cool the next day's fever. That's where the spindleweed helps. The one I planted by the old shed came in quick. They seem like they seem to like where the soil's dry. I'll try making an ointment with it tomorrow. Yeah, but they died before they got a chance to do that. Very sad. Very sad. This whole situation is sad. It's another thing about the Fallow Mire is it's like the most depressing place ever. And if you even think about stepping in the water, it calls zombies. <laughs> you don't even have to act. You don't have to actually, you know, step in it. You just think about it too hard, and suddenly, where's that big guy? Um, no me gusta. Look at you. Look at him hiding over there. What a jerk. It's a dead end. Or, or is it? Aha! Uh -huh. You can't, you can't stop me. I'm the friggin' inquisitor. I'm sure there's a road. Yep, there it is. <laughs> I got. I just took. Woo. Oh, it wasn't that bad. Shut up. It was barely even a fall. There's a zombie around here. Oh, and lightning. Lightning's always fun. Yeah, living here would suck. I mean, I'm sure it was fine when it wasn't all plaguey, <laughs> but now it's just unsettling. Oh, look at how cute they are. Let's see, I'm lost. It's been a- it's- this place sucks. That's all I'm saying. Alright, let's go back. We might have to step into the water. Oh wait, no, that's not a bridge. We might have to- this is- just what? 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 Well, it's it's gone. Calm down. It's gone. It decided to f off. Don't worry about it. Ooh, love lotus. It's a nice plant to have. I don't want to touch the water. That's when they decide to touch you. Look, he's still there. He's like, but huh, I'm just waiting. They'll come to the water eventually. <laughs> no, I won't. You can suck it. <laughs> Uh, I can't swim. This is the type of game where you can't swim, so I can't swim. Ooh, mystery! What do we got here? Oh, yes! That's right. It calls the dead. It's annoying. It's like... It's like a demon beacon. Watch out! Why? It's not- it's not- it's fine. No oh, fuck! No 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 Oh, oh hello! <laughs> How are you? Whoop! There we go. Oh, out of the 
the circle. And then get out. Get up. Fucking zombies. Die already. He decided that Solus was the best type of food. I already. Jeez. The beacons seem to draw out the undead. We could use them to fight on dry land. Yeah, yeah that's true. Um, I don't quite remember why they're here. There's, an, there's still an exclamation point here. Okay, which nice me to... The veil fire may prove useful. Yes. For some reason. There. Oh, there we go. Bellfire and the Fallow Mire. The Bellfire messages in the Fallow Mire are largely gibberish and imply a kind of paranoia. Certain letters and numbers repeat. It is possible the writing is in code. These Bellfire runes are interspersed with numbers and math mathematical notations. They evoke a clear sense of panic as if the author was trying to figure out a difficult problem. It's math. It's math, guys. I know that desperation. It's definitely math. I'm sorry, random dude. <laughs> it's not something any of us should be subjected to. Math is clearly the worst thing to ever happen. <laughs> uh, okay. We gotta go this way, I think. Let's see. I think the next bell fire is in this direction. Oh, hi! There we go. Some magic ass magic right there. There it is. You can see the little blue. The blue flames. These demons actually aren't that bad. You know, like fighting wise. Hold on though. Let's read this. Staring at this set of unreadable runes conjures up strong feelings of bitterness and arrogance in equal measure. They fade slowly. Right. Book. Apostate Widris's journal. There were years of notes in that book. Years. Who could have taken it or deciphered it? Did someone follow me from the circle? I bet it was Wernum or Clarice. Clarice? Cl whatever. They always were jealous little busybodies. If they saw what I've done, the demon I've harnessed, they'd be green with envy. Who's afraid of spirits now? You simpering use. Oh, yeah, you. I think you find this guy later. But I must have my book back. I will write down the cipher again before I forget. Again, these demons are clever. I can't have them demanding a price for decrypting my own notes. The concoction I can make with the plants here in safe amounts will open my mind to vistas past the fade. The demons hint it is beyond me because they wish to undermine me. It is so clear. It's so very clear. This guy was obviously psychotic. Is there another... Oh, is that the... There he is. There he is. Sure. Ah, no touchy the Inquisitor. They do not enjoy the undead hands. They are gross. Whoa, did you see that? Uh, healing magic, it's like playing freaking Final Fantasy. Oh, hi! <laughs> so nice of you to join us. I'm gonna get out of your circle of influence so you can't totally F me with your dumb magical power that I hate. Yeah, run away. You wiener. So fire and healing magic are going to be the best bet, it seems, for the Zambinos. Um, I dropped the- oh, there it is. I was gonna say, I dropped the torch. Thank you. Anything interesting? Stop. Stop making sounds. Most of these people just have, like, pieces of cloth on them because they're all corpsey and stuff, so... 
All right, let's take this. Uh, the next one. I don't think it this goes anywhere in this direction. That's a dead end. I think that's just another drop off. Yes, it is. Okay, so we got to go this way. Shut up. There should be another camp over here. Uh, inside, like a little chaos. Yeah, it's, it's in this direction. So depressing. This whole place sucks. I wonder why I'm not into the Fallow Mire. It's because it's the saddest location in the game. Like, literally the saddest. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah, it's in here. Only time I like to touch the water. <laughs> I have to go and... Aw, it's not a dead person. Smudge drawing. On this small note, the words not death root have been underlined three times. There's a small illustration of a plant that looks like spindleweed with, with this one underneath it. Did you eat the wrong plant and you decided to leave that as a message? Don't eat this one. It will kill you. And it did. Yay, it's a camp. Is there anything in this camp that I can have? Note from a scout. Warn the Herald his life is in danger if he comes to the mire. Our patrol spotted Avar three days ago. We didn't understand why they came down from the frostbacks until we were captured in an ambush. Their leader said they came because they heard the Inquisition was in the area. They went to lure out and kill the Herald of Andraste to win favor with their gods. I escaped, but I can't free the others without help. I found a good camping spot for a rescue party. We'll tend my wounds before heading off. Scout Aubrey Greenholm. Was that who that was in that cave? Miss the scout who was leaving me a message? <laughs> Poor guy. I hope not. That would suck. Seems like a nice enough person. I should probably level up, yeah. It'd be a smart thing to do. And let it be known that I never said I was exactly a genius. <laughs> Pyromancy. Let's do that one. Anybody else got anything they can spend? Nope. Go ahead and rest. Alright, um... On to the next little glowy goo. No sign of the Avar who want to challenge me, or the Inquisition soldiers. Yeah, we'll find him. Ooh, mine. I am supposed to be- let me see if I can mark that on my map. Little, um... Beacon. So this is where I've been. Beacon here. Beacons in the dark. There's one there. Yeah, and then this mission here. Um, I wouldn't say it's like hard, hard, but it's not easy either. <laughs> There's this. Um, Dude, Widris, who decided, excuse me, the Daughters of Song, this is the book, I'm really worried about what that might say. There he is. The guy, the first cloud man I meet. He's just waiting for me to fucking open this rift. Alright, here we go. It's weird finding one that's, you know, ow. That's just closed in the middle of the swamp. Oh, is he still not dead? Die. Jeez. Talk about a pain in the tuchus. Ah. Not in, don't like to be touched by strange monsters. Not really my thing. Please keep your hands to yourself at all times. Oh, well then. 
Can I, there we go. <laughs> Can I close it, please? <laughs> no, it's too pretty to close. It's like a nightlight and crazy people. Hi. So, you're Herald of Andraste. That's me. My kin want you dead, Lowlander. Nah, I don't care. Not my job. Everyone wants no me dead. From me. The other Abar kidnapped an Inquisition patrol. Mm -hmm. Are they all right? A few were injured in the skirmish, but they were alive. Last I saw them. Better be. Someone's trained them well. They killed more of us than I thought they would. Yeah, well, Cullen. It's Cullen. That's. Yep. I thought the Avar wanted to fight me. Our chieftain's son wants to fight you. Mm. I'm called him when the dead pile up. Rights to the gods. Mending for the bleeding. A dagger for the dying. That's what I do. There's a. Got, uh, a blade zombie. A trophy yep, there he is. Okay, and he's gone. I wonder where he went. What's he doing? Hold on. Oh, there he goes. Oh. Yeah, I didn't finish. He finally noticed us. <laughs> he didn't realize they were just fucking people sitting there having a full-blown conversation. Well, I guess our talk was over. Anyway. Hi. Okay, well, I guess that's it for us. Watch the water. Okay. <laughs> that zombie was just fucking minding his own business. <laughs> He's like, yep, and then he saw us and he's like, oh, there are people in the swamp. Bloodstone, ooh, I needed some of that holy shit. Now I just have to figure out what a Navaran is. I'm pretty sure this happens every time. Where I decide I want to be a necromancer and I'm like, what the hell's a Navaran? And I have to go look for it and I'm like, oh. Uh, the next place, I should be able to get to it. The road should take me to the next little little torchy place where I need to go. Should. It doesn't mean it will. Oh, there it is. Quite a smell. It's a swamp, so yes. It's gross here. Oh, I touched the water. I touched the yeah. water. Disturbing the water draws them out. <laughs> I touched the water, guys. Veilfire. These particular Veilfire runes are completely impenetrable, but staring at them brings about the mental image of some kind of plant, and the impression it is somehow important, then it fades. Yep. Alright. Here we go. Uh oh. There's more than one begging. And electricity for the zombinos and stupid people that I hate. No, no, no. I don't know which one to hit. Uh oh. <laughs> Too many zombies. Muck off. I hate that power. It's because it knocks you stupid. Woo, the zombies hate healing magic. It's good to know, honestly. Stop it with the jumping around like a bunch of psychos. Christ. Andraste on a crutch. I don't know what god I would worship if I was in this situation. You know, I would probably worship Solus just out of spite. Just to piss him off. Because <laughs> he'd be like, stop it. And I'd be like, you stop it, you dumb liar. <laughs> he'd be like, such a bitch. And I'd be like, you started it with your lies. So don't even go there, mister. Let's call him Mr. Mr. Man. Thank of ocean. I can't see a damn thing. There we go. Oh my god! Why does he have such a boner for me? Get away from me! I don't even like you like that. She's in rice. It's like having overly enthusiastic stalkery fans. Well, I don't mind over enthusiastic people. It's more of just the weird, crazy, you know what I mean. You know, like that would be, I'd be the one that's like, guys, guys, calm down. It's okay. <laughs> it's alright. Just a normal dude. 
trying to do normal things. You can calm down now, Cassandra. It's okay now. We did it, honey. It's okay. <laughs> um, anything of interest? Just, ooh, it's a bag. Let's get that. Uh huh. All right. And uh, oh, 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 there's more. More of that. Cool. All right. And next is this direction. And this should be. I think it's the last. The last beacon. This one. All right. Up I go. Yeah, generally I jump, you know, but I couldn't remember if you could with the this in. Hey, what you doing? Bandit stuff? That's cool. What you doing, buddy? It's like nothing. Oh, wasn't doing anything either. You know, just um, just being the inquisitor. You know how that is. Yeah. Ooh, it's a new shield. It means I can get rid of the old stuff. All right. Ooh, another book. Cool, cool. Yeah, it's about a place I don't want to read about right this second. I might not read everything to you guys. I apologize. If there's something that you've seen that I picked up that you wanna you want me to um you want me to read just tell me and I'll go back filter through it find it and read it to you nice okay some good stuff in there to get to this last what 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 did you see that wait oh just blood lotus okay hello all right this is what we're gonna do and you guys are already in the water. And it's only if my feet touch the water. For some reason, it's fine if the others do it. But if my feet touch the water, that's when the real problems start. I need that back. I need that back. I need my, I need my torch. There we go. All right. Hey, guys. More zombie stuff, huh? Yeah, I get you. I like to do zombie stuff sometimes. It was a zombie ambush. Why do I find that so weird? You know, like zombies don't usually, you know, have the time or the patience to have an ambush. So it's the fact that they actually set up a zombie ambush that's kind of just fascinating. <laughs> like they're just like you know what we're gonna do it's like what we're gonna ambush these fools but Steve we're zombies yeah and what we can't ambush people now we're not allowed <laughs> it's, like, it's just not something the zombies do man it's like well I'm changing that that, that perspective right there we're gonna start ambushing people like, what are we gonna do with the stuff that we get huh we're zombies alright we don't even wear clothes. I don't know why I devolved into like a weird East Coastiness with them, but just trust me when I say that that's how zombies talk. All right, they have an East Coast accent. Didn't you know? If I was a zombie, that's what I would do. I would set up ambushes for people. You know. Why not? What's this? Let's just see. Balefire and the- oh. These unreadable runes evoke for a moment a sudden and overpowering feeling of smug and vengeful triumph, as though a difficult problem has been solved. There is the image of a bottled elixir, then it fades. A cipher written in the last pages of Apostate Widrus's journal corresponds to the Balefire writing found in the Fallow Mire. The deciphered messages are notes that, when taken together, form instructions on how to concoct a particularly dangerous poison. Delicious. And I can't remember what lighting the Veilfire actually does in this area. I think it helps chase away the monsters and stuff. 
Um, it works as a kind of barrier for them. I think. I don't actually know. I have a feeling he's gonna come up here. Hey, Solus, you're fine up there alone, right? Oh, he came back. <laughs> and here he goes again. Dude, bull, we got potions for a reason, dude. He's just freaking sitting there not even giving a shit. Die already. <laughs> Instead of use my friggin' Inquisitor Rift power to deal with these guys. I hate that they can like teleport around like that. It's irritating as all hell. Yeah, make sure I stay out of this circle of influence when he starts doing that shit. It stuns the shit out of you and then you fall on your head and and, you're, and then you're broken and brain dead after that. Woo! We did it. We have a path free of corpses back to the shore. Yeah, that's Can't right. Wait to use it. They don't like, um, they don't like the Velfire, the uh, the zombies and stuff. So they stay away from that area. And I'm guessing that that stupid magical jerk whose journal I found is probably the one who put him out. He's a jerk. Okay. We did it. It's a ghost. This is just a ghost. It's only like 50 ghosts. There's probably some more zombies though. They're always fun. Look at this stuff. It's so cool. Oh yeah. So this part here, there are so many zombies that you can't fight them all. More are dead. Uh, Too many of them. Let's yeah. get to the castle. And anytime, no matter who you're with in this team, um, they'll be like, no, 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 there's too many zombies. We gotta get out of here. So it's just good to just keep going. Don't engage. Run as fast as you can. Oh no! Wait, wait, wait. There's a thing. There's a thing. There's something around here that's important. I know. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. I'm just looking to see if it's up here. Oh, there's something around here. Well, you guys do what you want. I'm just looking around. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, hi. There's a thing you have to use to close off the- Ow, they're a bar and they have bows! Shit. There's a thing up here you have to get to. To close the gate. There it is. It closes one side and then opens the other. Now what we're gonna do... Nice. Let's go down here and take care of these guys. Hey, Sola. Sorry I left you guys hanging. I know. You 
guys, you're, you're fine. You made it. It's all right. I can't hit him. I'm not close enough. Okay. Yeah, the zombies are on the other side now. All right. Now we can actually explore this place. The undead can attack at any time. Well, yeah, because they're zombies. Of course they can. It's just the way the undead work, honey. Honey bunches of oats. Doesn't she get mad if I constantly called her that? You know what I mean? She just get pissed after a while. She's like, fuck you. Dude, look, it's not my fault. Oh, no. Well, I don't have that perk anyway. I don't I think... I don't know if I can. Yeah, I don't know. I think there's some opportunities that you just kind of miss. Um... Depending on your skill set. I don't have the deft hands and fine tools. In fact, I don't know how long it took me to actually get that, the, you know, the last time I played. Oh, it must have been outside. It had to have been. Oh well. Hey guys. Hey, uh, is there a thing out there? Probably. Probably a note or something. The zombies don't like me because I like to tease them from the other side of the gate. Oh, so let's, you should probably heal. I just picked up a crap ton of potions, so... Alright. Let's continue. Looking for our bros. Hello! Sometimes I like to make things burn. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just a little insane. I think those are women. Huh. I, I think that their society has like a different... Uh, well, I mean, there's not like a lot of like sexism or whatever going on here, but they probably have a whole thing. Where they're like, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, they'll tear you in half probably quicker than the men will. It's like, nice. <laughs> okay, here we go, guys. You ready to fight this asshole? Herald of Androste! That's me. What? Who are you? Why should I care? Here it comes, that asshole. Here it comes. Yeah, I bet you're scary. You look like you're probably a scary person. No, I'm not interested. Now what I am interested in is fucking blowing these two assholes up. Woo! They got some arrows! I'm gonna get out of you! Oh, hey, they came- hey, they followed me! Fuck off! Damn! I forgot how much their archers suck. Nope. 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 Hate the archers. Die already. <laughs> He's such a jerk. I hate this guy. He's like, I'm going to kill the Herald of Andraste. And it's like, yeah, I bet. I bet your dad's going to be proud, too. But he's not. But he's not going to give. This is the only shit he's gonna give us throwing goats at us. Because you're an idiot. I can't remember what it is the dad says. 
A redheaded mother breeds a brat, I think is what he said. <laughs> Which, this guy was a redhead. And he was a brat. And I'm guessing he got the red hair and the attitude from Mummy. Hi guys! Herald of Andraste. I dealt with the Avar. Is everyone alright? Yes, your word. The injured need some rest, but we can return on our own. I can't believe the Herald came for us. I told you he wouldn't leave us. It's always nice to hear like you know, people are all like, oh, I thought for sure he'd abandon us. It's like, fuck no, you guys are like family to me. I don't care how many soldiers there are. Ooh, I gotta... Blackwall would have liked to have been here for this. Whoops. Well, how am I supposed to know where everything is? Don't blame me for the game not being, you know, more... <laughs> I just don't check my map. I can't really blame the game for that. <laughs> it's something I just don't check my map. That is a chair. <laughs> I thought it was a treasure chest at first, because it's the way it was tipped over. Alright, we did it! And now this bro here is going to be our bro to bro about with. What up? Hello? Hi. I don't really have one. Heal the wounds in her skin. Probably. Right. I'll join you. Let me make peace with my kid and I'll find where you set your flag. You'll like it there. I hear you come from the mountains. I make friends everywhere. I got friends in low and high places. Bull, you look like you're covered in blood there, buddy. <laughs> well, that was fun. We should be heading back now. That was definitely something. Let's go reopen this gate and get the H out of here. Maybe I can find that thing that my little, you know, searchy doodad wanted me to find. Ooh. I know there's something you don't have to keep telling me, I know. I know. There's a lot of zombies out here. Guess why? Probably why it smells so bad. Everyone thinks it's just a swamp. No, it's the fact that the entire place is just underneath. It's mostly corpses. Alright. You know, you don't have to... <laughs> it's just that Josephine said in judgment for the prisoner. It's it's that. Oh well, all right. Well, have fun, have fun out there, zombie. You just kind of left. Um, it's that guy's dad. <laughs> She's like, so we heard a sound, and it turned out this guy was throwing goats at the castle. It's like, oh yeah, huh, something, something throwing goats. I don't even know if you can kill all the zombies. I'm just curious. <laughs> there's a lot out there. and I mean, there's like a lot of zombies out there. Like, way too many to even imagine uh, having to deal with. They're way less intimidating now that I'm not running for my life. Like the whole group. Dorian would love this place. You know, because it's full of zombies. Yeah, they're not so tough, it looks like. Just annoying. Hey, Bull, you stuck, buddy? He is. He's frozen. Hey, 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 hey. Yep. I think he had a seizure. Anyway. He'll be fine. Don't worry about it. I was trying to find whatever is it wants me to over here. I keep saying it's in this direction, but that would mean it's inside the castle. And I didn't notice anything. Uh, let's go. Alright, hold on. Where is it? Maybe I'm just the dumb one. 
There's no way to get... Oh, is it in... It's in there. It's just like pinging it. Because it's dumb. Look at all those Zambinos! Fire! Is that a good idea? Probably not. <laughs> Probably a bad idea. Probably a mistake. I don't know. Could have been. I mean, it's experience, right? Why not? Whoa, 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 whoa. You need to slow down there, buddy. Bull's having a good time, I'm sure. He's like, fuck yeah. I don't think I've ever actually killed all the zombies out here. I think I usually just, you know, fast travel back to a campground. Go from there. I am gonna have to go back to um, Skyhold, though, to talk to people. Because... Oops. It's kind of important. Yeah. Cassandra, why don't you just call more over here? That would be fantastic. We all want more zombies. And without them, what are we gonna do? More zombies is better zombies. Everyone knows that. I gotta check my timer real quick. Alright. Well then. That was, um... Quite a lot of zombies. But I think we did good, guys. I, I, I do. I think we did really good. What other missions do we have here in the Falamire? What is this? Oh, that's the thing I can't get to. I need to... What's that? Yeah. I need to get my deft hands and, um... Find tools thing. What's this? What is this? I'm gonna go here to this blue... This exclamation point over here. What is that? It's this way. I am curious. Look at that. You see that? Oh, of course. I would love to step in zombie-infested water. The hell? Cabin key required. I see you in there. Nice try, noob cake. Hey, you got you seen a key anywhere? Mm, guess not. Hey. What? Wait. Aha! Uh -huh, I found it. Found the key. Come on. Come on, guys. We're going in here. There's a, there's a ghost. Not a very good one. Because I can see him through the window. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoops, that was my fault. Waterlogged diary. The diamond roof leaks. The, the diamond. The damned roof leaks, and I've been eating boiled roots for a week. I'm squatting in a bog no one so much as spit in for ten years. Still better than the alienage. Think Andraste. That's the last time I visit the city for a while. I'm worried about the gardeners. They weren't sick when I left, and now they're all down with a fever, and their little boy is at death's door. Nigel Marsh said we should lock them in their home, the sour codger. Maybe I can bring something to help. Is it death root that cures a fever or elf root? It can't be death root, can it? Ask Ira which is right. It's not. It has death in the name, dude. It's not death root. <laughs> is it death root? That thing that says death? Yes. Yep. That's exactly the one you should be giving kids uh, if you don't want them to die of a fever. It's death root. <laughs> I'm sorry. I shouldn't be being so mean, but um. Really? Don't touch me. I don't like being touched. That's right. Run away. Come on, guys. We're just gonna leave it alone. Nope. We're gonna leave it alone. Because it was my fault it got all aggressive in the first place. So if we just walk away, it'll stop doing that. Nope. Come on. Come on. We're not doing that. Let's go. Let's go. It's not a big deal. 
Not a big deal. Fight that ghost if you want to fight something. Well, we're not gonna fight the... We're gonna leave the buffalo thing alone, because it didn't really do anything until I accidentally... Whoop! Nope, not close enough, I guess. It didn't do anything until I stupidly shot it with my electricity. What's that? Oh, is it another one? Shut up! Alright, let's get somewhere not here. And this... This is where that Widris guy is, which he's all... He's, he's all lich looking now. And I don't like it. We're gonna go back to... Why can't I go to Skyhold? Why not? Well then we'll go... Oh, is it because there's a monster around? It's gotta be because there's a monster around. Well, let me know. Yes, okay. Oh, it's because we were all engaged. You know. Alright, well. I think I'm gonna do two episodes again, because I can. <laughs> and you guys seem to like watching, uh, watching me play. Dragon Age Inquisition, and of course I enjoy playing Dragon Age Inquisition, so I'm going to go ahead and stop this one here, and then we'll start a new one, okay? Alright, I'll be back in just one second, guys.